Pins? Yeah, they need some of my blood. Oh, make, make sure I'm healthy so I can be around for a long, long time. And you can eat? I can't eat yet. No. I can eat after. After you die, what? After I shot my dope. Forgot daddy. What did I forget? I did not forget anything. On their, on their, uh, uh, make clothes? Feet, they have claws. They have claws, and they can dig with those. Um, is that thing so big? Can they go with a hole? Uh huh. Alright, let me go get some blood. Be right back. Agency Heroes, which we're going to talk about. This is this is, woo, it's going to be gold for people. Um, I'm really excited about that. That's probably the best way I can make people successful is by giving them exactly what made me successful and giving it to them for free. So this is another employee of mine. He started with my company about three and a half years ago. He does random jobs. Um, he's more like a, I guess, a freelancer subcontractor, but he's been working with me for a long time. So. Not really employ like Mario, which has, has schedule payments. Um, basically, what's going on now is we're going to build, uh, we're going to build a program that that website rabbit that thing that's doing seventy eight thousand. We're going to take that and I'm going to open source it. And I'm going to give it away for free to everybody to use, and we're just going to charge a small percentage for processing. Um, it's gonna be awesome. So Sumanta is gonna build that, and it's gonna be a hybrid where it's gonna go from it's gonna be available on uh, Play Store, App Store, and a, a website, and it will help agency owners kind of blow up. It's gonna be pretty cool. I'm really excited about that. So we have a meeting for that today, and then uh, that's the agency heroes because we're gonna be really we're gonna rescue agencies that are in distress. I have two spots in my exclusive club. That was a five thousand dollar offer. And if Wayne, after we finish building it, and there's still space, because I only work with 24 customers, me personally, exclusively, if, if that process of me working with Wayne was good and fruitful, and we both came out with a win-win, and his customers are winning, that win-win-win that I keep talking about, if that, win, that happens with him, then yes, I'll invite him to the exclusive club. And then I'll work for him monthly and, and help him and coach him on what to do next and and you know like move him along because he's an old school marketer he knows his stuff but there's a lot of new technology that he's not familiar with or he hasn't implemented yet so he's actually circling back around now after 10 or 15 years and updating his best programs and his best stuff and you know making it better making it more for higher quality because when he recorded it you know it wasn't dslrs it was like three chips uh chipset uh cameras you know, like, so, like, there's there's updates to do. And this is one, by the way, his account has, like, 280 sales funnels, all active, all working, all making money. So, like, this is one out of possibly 280. Not to mention that he has groups, uh, email email uh, lists with hundreds, if not millions of people. The dude's been doing it for 12 years. You know, like, that could severely benefit my company if this goes well. So, like... You gotta take that into consideration too. So I'm gonna, ideally he signs up for the exclusive club and I do work for him or he gets me so many clients that I'm like, hey, I'm gonna comp your exclusive club. I'm gonna invite you to my mastermind because you're bringing so much business to me and we're making so much money together. We're having a win-win-win. I've been on a diet for like six, seven months. No, six months, about six months. And uh, basically when uh, we got pregnant the second time, I said, okay, I'm going to go on a seafood diet where I eat everything I see. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, you know, as, a, as my son was getting close to being born and uh, I wanted to start being uh, on social a little bit more, I wanted to put more hours in my business. And uh, I said, well, I'm going to go on social media. I'm going to be a, I'm going to have this, this online image again or, or or my pictures everywhere, videos everywhere, whatever, I have to get in shape. So I went on a diet after the pregnancy, uh, or right before my son was born, I was like, I'm going on a diet three, four months before, and 
Over the last six months, I lost 42 pounds. Um, and I'm like, a, 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 I got to a weight where it's kind of like plateaued, right? So like it's hard, harder to lose weight now, uh, even though I'm running a calorie deficit. So next, next thing is a gym. I need you to get one, two, three, four, five. Give me five of these pieces. Yeah. Thank you, scissors. But I'm missing, yeah, two of those, two of those, two of those. There you go. That's what I'm missing. So if you go to Home Depot and get those, I will finish building your gym. If you're gonna spend money on advertising, please be there to get the sales. What do you mean you spend it as a specialist? Where's my money? So right now, Samantha is telling me that he's going to, uh, the agency here that we were planning, he's going to first develop it as a website platform. And then we're gonna make it instead of a hybrid like I wanted to. He said we shouldn't do hybrid. Let's just make them native. Native means that we're building each thing for its native platform. Which means if we're building an Android app, it's gonna be only for the Android phone. An iOS app only for the iOS app. A website only for the website. Those are three separate platforms, but they're all connecting the same database. So a hybrid version is one app that's responsive to all all platforms. What we're doing is much, much better. That's how Facebook is built or Instagram or any of those apps. They're built natively for multiple platforms. Sumata. Can I hear you? All right, so you can hear me? All right, cool. So just let me know uh, when, when uh, if, if, if you don't get something. All right, so I'm gonna go over the. Let me put up the chat so I can see. We need a. Here's the things we need the app to have. Uh, the front end is gonna be a free account. Okay, the free website uh, gets them into an editor. And then they have to, we have to have a process for one or two things. One, free hosting. I think that's better, right? They get a custom domain. Correct. So for the paid version, they'll do a search, right? You'll have to, like on Website Rabbit, we have the search domain thing. Uh, it has sales scripts, copy for websites. Copy, copy, yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it's, a, it's a custom generator. Uh, they're going to have, uh, manage manage website then the next thing uh, is called the affiliate program okay affiliate users you know how to create affiliate accounts affiliate users inactive users income that they're winning contests that you could start up uh, affiliate payouts would be through uh, mass pay Okay, um, I'll send you some money. Send me uh, a text message with anything else you need from me. Uh, okay, sure. And send me the PayPal and me address, uh, your PayPal and me address, and I'll send you some cash to get started. Okay, sure. Okay? Yeah. All right, let's, let's yeah. get this. Yeah, sure. I'm excited. All right. Hey, did you, did you ever find out for me about, so I, I've been trying to develop another app that we haven't been able to develop yet, uh, which is mm -hmm. a multi-platform streaming service on a phone so you like you you'll log on to your phone you go facebook instagram twitter uh linkedin uh, yeah. pinterest and you press uh -huh. the button and you go live mm -hmm. whoosh it goes live in all those places yeah. so yeah i follow the instagram api and facebook api till now how about, okay, how, I will show uh, you, yeah actually i will show you a demo yeah show me a demo i want to see a demo yeah yeah sure all right, awesome. All right, send me your PayPal and me, and I'll send you some money. Okay, okay, right. sure.
Thank you. Thank Bye. you. Bye. Bye. Oh, the mics are here. All right. We can start shooting some stuff. Mics. Uh, what do I need? What came back again? why you reconfirm two separate forms yeah I, I need it though because then I can't even send the basic quote so how do I get the zip zip I can go to the email campaign and get the zip from that yeah but you don't need to do that when you call them you say hey you just filled the thing I have a problem with the zip codes what are they so I can pull up your quote and send it over correct yeah but in that situation where they don't pick up the phone I would want to also send a fake quotation now even with the drip email I want to send a quote for like you know what yeah so so just send it with the email so I just go in the mail chip? Yeah, you can go into your mail chip. Alright. Okay. Alright. Alright. We'll talk again. I'll, yeah. I'll call you at the end of the day. I'm about to record some stuff. Okay. Alright. All right, take that mic off. Stop that camera. Let me pull up the the old masterclass and see what the the all our subjects are, and let's just do it. Knock out a couple of modules today. It'll be fine. And finish. Oh no, because we got. Oh, we're gonna go downstairs, right, to the studio. All right, let's get it rock and roll. Are you recording? Yep. Oh, okay, you're recording this whole time. All right. Okay, welcome. No. All right. Okay, so let's just stop it, start it from scratch. I got it, I know where I'm going. All right, you have access to the masterclass. So let's get into it. Let me, I'm gonna do that whole shit again, De delete that, I don't like it. I don't like any of it. Yo, did you get, did you get any leads today or no? Okay. There, you might want to stop both of them. There's a truck here right now about to do a delivery and there's a plane that just flew by. And today we're going to go over stealth content marketing and you will learn the inside scoop how to... dollars he paid for it and he missed it. What? What do you mean missing?
So this is both bags. Uh, and it was shipped last week. It looks like it's packaged pretty well. Alrighty. Oh yeah. This, this reflective line, we've parted. So it's gonna be actually two smaller lines. Added padding for the back for comfort. So when you put it up against your back, you don't feel the trolley. Um, we've added an expandable pocket because the other pocket, you know, some people have large phones, some people have small phones. So we've added an expandable one so you can uh, put your pocket in there. And it's breathable, see? And because it's breathable, you can have your pocket on, your, your cell phone on, play music or whatever with accessories um, at, at, at any time, which is awesome. So you could take this, right? And you're just gonna put it in. Now this phone can be on, and this is, uh, oh, check this out. Because we had a problem when we were rolling it, look, right, it drags. So what we've done to fix that is we've added mountaineering clips in here as well. And you can take these off. And now when you wanna wheel it, you could just put them in the pocket and it becomes a trolley. This is actually, uh, we use the same fabric for both bags. It's actually a water, almost a waterproof material. Okay, it's a highly water resistant material. Inside the bag, of course, you is waterproof for the, for the actual container inside. Look at that, that's, and you got this huge space inside. You could put like, probably like four, four liters in there with a few bags of chips. And the second one I made, because we're kind of along this theme, look at this. This is the ultimate fishing bag. All of this is reflective. All of the print is reflective for nighttime. Titan is a fishing line. Uh, and they're actually promoting this bag. Bam. So you have an inside compartment and this, actually you can close the bag here. And then you have uh, a little, another tech pocket here. Again, another tech pocket. Now here you would put, slide your battery right in here. Again, breathable. A lot of these bags that people are designing, they're not well thought out. This bag has $50,000 worth of engineering behind it. So that's pretty, it's pretty cool. These things are gonna hit the streets. Let me uh, actually, you know, let me see if I can get Jeff on the line for a second. I'm not sending him. He already has one bag. I send him a bag. It's up to him to sell it because I'm going to go sell it around here anyway. In the back of these padded things is this little pocket. And this. So proud of this. This is uh, the park bag official chair. And uh, let me see. Uh, did I open it up the wrong way? I think I did. Okay. You might have to pause here until I figure out how to open. Huh? Oh, I put it in the wrong. That's why. Okay. Cause this is the right way. Like this is it right here, but this is, is backwards. Uh, all right. And it opens up like that. And then, okay, no, I didn't have it right. Got it. You're gonna be our test uh, subject. Should we do it at the gym on a padded area? Sure. Cause, uh, okay, go ahead and uh, if you fall, don't worry. How's that? a small chair, but it fits right in the back of the bag. It's good enough. It's good, you know, I think you have something to sit on. Okay, yeah, you're not a good salesperson. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's really small. It basically sucks. That's what she said. <laughs> All right, let's see. Ah! Ah, cramp. <laughs> <laughs> this is not funny. Oh! <laughs> You could, you could one day spend $200 per click, but then, then the next day spend 50 cents per click, and then it averages 
Ten yeah. bucks for a clip. You... No, I know. I just wanted to make sure that I'm reading. You're right. And there was 118 for that clip. Because then, because you went on, on more of just we need a lead that comes in rather than just people are trying to look. Correct. Crystal? Okay. Because there, there is also with the, with the Illinois, there's like some of the areas that's going underneath the bottom. Like we don't even drive there. But whatever. I want to fix everything first and then we're going to reorganize January. So we'll work that shit out. It's fine. Alright, um. Alright, so let me, I gotta fucking take this, uh, I gotta call one. Go, don't miss any more calls. Uh, I don't know. Alright. Alright. Alright, back. Campaign's starting to get leads. And he misses calls. It's his money. $118 he paid for it and he missed it. Never have me answer the phone if he's doing sales. You never pick up your phone. Like, ever. Because I'm busy and I got kids. I'm busy too. I still answer. Look, I'm eating and I'm taking sales calls. Right, but I don't expect anyone to call me, Papa. Must be nice. Most of you can expect me to I call you. I think she filtered my calls. She's like, hmm. I'm not gonna answer. I'm not gonna answer. The I know. I'm kidding. It was a joke, of course. Or was I? All right. Let's see what we got. So let's. Now, now the interesting thing is, right? Mike got his first conversion, so that's good. He missed the call. Bad. If you're going to spend money on advertising, please be there to get the sales. <laughs> You'll do better. This looks like one of my uh, my coaching students right there. <laughs> What's up, George? My money at the moment is destroyed. I've been I have I've been having a row with Freud for the last three weeks because money went missing from my account. What? What yeah, do you mean missing? About I think it's about eight thousand pounds of my money went missing. Okay, we'll do we'll send this to a specialist. What do you mean you spend this to a specialist? Where's my money? Yeah, and then I literally back and forth, back and forth. And then I, and then one day they was getting pissed off at me, so I piss off. We handle hundreds of millions of accounts. No one of our accounts has ever had this problem, yeah? I was like, well, clearly it has. How's the funnel performing? Yeah, good. It's uh, good. People are happy with it. People getting sales, obviously, like the smart link with Wayne Funnel, that's working. Because I got sales from someone who didn't change that link. Well, we, we actually re recorded uh, the entire mindset portion of the funnel shift. So I can give you access to that and set up an affiliate network when you're ready to launch the mindset. You already have the mindset promo that I made for you. It's like 20 minutes, um, but the mindset whole course is, is really good. And then they're talking about me. And they're like, hey. nice. Yeah, and they're like, what we we uh, we go. What was he said? Like, Did you download that video and take clip that snippet? Okay, good. Well, let's put it in a video and edit a video for you. I, I get it. I get it. They think they can do it themselves. Good. Let them try. That's a compliment to you. All right. Cool. I'll get it done for you. Later, later. Good luck. There is a coronavirus, or what they're calling the coronavirus, not the beer, <laughs> um, in Asia right now. And these things have have a way of spreading everywhere so um, with as bad as it is in the news right now uh, in Asia I, I think we should change the bag a little bit to fit more uh, we right now I already know we're gonna double stitch this this clip on but I was like thinking of accessories for the bag uh, and, and have something for for anybody that's that's suffering through this so like what I, I decided to do is first of all I wanted to add more reflective stripes for nighttime safety and this is a solar panel battery charger with a compass and a flashlight and it has three USB ports 
So, and it's also waterproof. Inside the cooler bag, um, there, there's a liner. Um, it is, if you use this and it's, it's watertight, waterproof, and uh, you can keep medicine or foods or anything that's really vital cool if, God forbid, the power goes out. So you have this cooler or you could just use it as a, as a backpack, you know, like, which is pretty, pretty awesome.